Greetings, Southern travelers. We're here near Columbia, Tennessee, south of Nashville. And this is the historic Elm Springs, Elm Springs House. And it was built in 1837. Two brothers built it for their sister. Uh, there's more information online about Elm Springs, but apparently the two brothers built this for their sister. And I believe there was, the sister then had a family. There was a children and whatnot. So it's on this beautiful site. There's about 85 acres here. They have tour guides, but the tour guide is not here today. I think it's $8 to do the tour. Old-timey house. Also on the site is the National Confederate Museum and headquarters for the Sons of Confederate Veterans. And that building contains a museum. It's a $5 tour. There's a gift shop. Uh, it was completed in uh, 2020. Also here on Elm Springs property is this statue. This is a statue of General Nathan Bedford Forrest, Confederate general. Originally this statue was in Memphis and they brought it down here. It's uh, gonna get a pedestal and uh, I believe it's bronze. Stands pretty tall. Also here at Elm Springs is the grave of Nathan Bedford Forrest and his wife, Mary. Also here is this grave of Simeon W. Cummings, an Alabama soldier for the Confederacy. This would be a typical grave for a soldier, pointed headstone, and the kind of a iron metal looking foot marker. Here we have a family cemetery. The Todd family, I guess, and the Loonies. I think the brothers for that built the house were their last name was Looney. And the marker here, this this tall one is a James Todd. He passed away in the 1845, he was 21 years old. And this would be a typical kind of a family cemetery. They pull rocks out of the pasture and build a little wall around it. This would probably keep the cattle from walking around in here. And these kind of tombs, above ground tombs. statue of Robert E. Lee. And we have a statue of Jefferson Davis, President of the Confederate States of America from 1861 to 1865. Here's the entrance to the museum. A lot of big beams and stonework on it. 
got a nice metal roof on it too. Well, it's a nice museum here. It's five bucks for the tour. Come on, check it out. It's off of Highway 50, just east of Columbia. Got the museum and the, the mansion over there, the Elm Springs house. Old Dottie Jackson's getting a little nap. Well, we're headed south. We're headed back to the Picayune. We're taking Interstate 65, Huntsville, Birmingham, and then on the 59 down to Meridian, and on on the part on the places beyond. All right, from. Uh, Elm Springs, Tennessee. Coastal Kev. See you on the road.